Hi, I'm Val with Hammer in Hand out here at the Pumpkin Ridge Passive House, and we're gonna pick back up. We left off on a video talking about our exterior air sealing. It was quite a while ago now, um, and we're gonna pick back up and talk about how that air sealing continues from the exterior of the house into the window box. So before we, t we talked about how we were using joint and seam to seal the, uh, the joints at the panels and uh, how our window box protrude out. And they protrude out because there's another uh, Larson truss built out here, which is a nine and a half inch eye joist that's going to basically nail up like that. And then this gets sheeted over again. Um, <clears throat> so what we're doing, we talked about how we air seal the buck to the sheathing and how our air barrier is continuing across the face of this sheathing and out out this window buck and then back in and then that's where the air barrier will then seal to the window um, so if we take a take a look in here we have coated this not only with the joint and seam that we originally put on there to give us some good air sealing and then we've uh, we've come back with the Prosoco the fast flash material and this is a liquid applied flashing membrane so this is protecting our window buck from moisture intrusion. What will happen with the Larson truss, it gets sheathed on the outside again. So there will be sheathing on the outside here, which is agapon in this situation. And that acts as our insulation cavity. It retains our insulation in the Larson truss. And the agapon itself is the uh, weather resistive barrier as well. That will come once that's installed, we will continue this liquid flashing across to the front of the agapon, completing our weather resistive barrier. The window will be installed in the center of the wall cavity, which is pretty much the center of this window buck from outside to inside. So right about in here where this slope, where the slope starts is going to be the front of the window. This window is a little different than what you'd see in a traditional two by six wall assembly in that it is much higher performance, but also it doesn't have a flange. A typical window would nail out here with a, with a flange. This will just uh, be attached, fastened through the window frame or with a, a clip. We, we plan on installing the windows and, air se and sealing the windows and performing a blower door before we build our Larson truss, therefore, therefore ensuring that all our air sealing is in fact good before we cover it up and it's not accessible.